for the family, I'd get it. Mama told me I was gifted, never trust nobody else before God. Now that's religion, I'm success bound. Them fake friends won't come around. Gotta get this weight up so I stay up. I'm pound for pound. Who can you trust in this world full of friends who turn fiends? Hey. What's up, what's up? This is Dub. And Nisha. Dub. And Nisha. This is Dub. And Nisha. Dub. And Nisha. Dub. And Nisha. And Nisha. Hey. Hey. <laughs> Back to you, ladies and gentlemen, another video today, you feel me? Back with another video. Even though this was a great Father's Day weekend, man. It I definitely was. enjoyed it, man, this past weekend. They, Happy they Father's up. Day they to all. The fathers out yeah, of there. Of course, of course, man. They did their thing for me. So, in light of that, we have to do this reaction to Black Ron. Nobody cares about dads. Uh, we did the one about the mom, uh, or something regarding moms. It wasn't the same type of bag, but you know, let's get on the dads real quick. Let's but just, this let's one, I kind of can agree with because I do feel like a lot of fathers don't get the credit they deserve. My family care about me though, because they showed me <laughs> with gifts every day of the week. I think from Thursday yeah, till Thursday Father's Sunday. Day. On Sunday, I was getting gifts. So I really appreciate them. Wifey, kids, I love y'all for real, for real. So let's get into this one. Make sure you run the like, subscribe, keep on sharing. Let's and go. Follow us on social media. And Black Ron is funny too. We saw him for the first time uh, at the No Cap Comedy Tour. Oh. That was him. He the first one that went up. So okay. He's pretty funny. woman waiting on no dude to do a whole ass thing in life. They're not even waiting on you to die. They will hurry up and get you there. <laughs> That's what hospice is, nigga. That is the hospital for niggas that ain't died yet. Dog. You need to go in there and lay him down on his side and keep rotating him till he gonna get out of him. Not Ooh. rotating him. Nobody put their mama in hospice. No, you put your daddy in hospice, goddamn. Uh, your mama come live in the back room with you and shit. You check on your mama. <laughs> your daddy, you don't even take him to the facility. You let the people come get his ass. Damn. Somebody give a fuck about their daddy. Y'all don't. Y'all don't give a damn about y'all daddy. Ain't nobody ever said, nigga, I'll kill everybody in here. And that's on my daddy. Ain't nobody ever said that. <laughs> Ain't nobody ever put it on their daddy. <laughs> they don't. They don't. They don't. They don't. On your mama, though? On your mama? You ain't never seen a nigga wet. Some daddies ain't there, though, so. You ain't never seen a nigga win the whole championship and get on the camera and be like, hey, daddy. <laughs> they do be like that, though. They do. That's true. I mean. You never seen a nigga win a BET award and be like, I want to thank God and my daddy. <laughs> <laughs> Never. <laughs> niggas' daddies, niggas' daddies are up there with like middle school teachers. I'm dead. Dog. <laughs> we can only serve as a fucking inspiration for a nigga that blew up who wasn't supposed to be shit in life. Like, wow. My daddy never loved me. My teacher never said I was gonna be shit. Like them two, them two positions right there. <laughs> is the same. My daddy never loved my, me. <laughs> dog, hold on. Let me make sure the volume. Father walked out on me. I wasn't good in social studies. Them the same. <laughs> I wasn't good in social studies. We were not the same, but I mean, I dog. I, I, I want to meet these teachers that was really talking to niggas and telling them that they wasn't gonna be shit. I said that too. Like, you had a teacher like that? No, because it's always it's always niggas. Yeah, that is true. Niggas be saying that, but that's because you really was trash in class. I mean, bro. some people was like really bad. Though. Yeah, like, and they especially the kids nowadays. They a whole different type and of breed. Teachers will only say that because like, bro, you disrupting being a disruptive person like that doesn't necessarily mean you're going to constitute to be in an upstate now they upstate. got like now they got social media and the phones they be catching these teachers on candy camera yeah bro hey. that's the only thing that suck about it nowadays yeah what type of bona fide educational worker is this that was like you know you you ain't gonna be shit in oh. life <laughs> go to lunch like what go to lunch <laughs> This for all my teachers that told me I wasn't going to amount to anything, nigga. If they all told you they was not lying, nigga, you would right. use up that bullshit. Right? right. Always. Skipping school, smelling like tater tots and shit. You was up at that Ooh. school fucking up. <laughs> you hit a lick. Not like tater tots. You're the only nigga that can rhyme words with orange and you fucked around. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> he I'm said you dead. hit a lick. So oh, no, I think they rhyme words with orange. Life during the quarantine. The rap is named Moneybag Yo. Y'all might have heard of him. Oh, wow. yeah. I don't like niggas. I don't like bitches. I don't like nobody. I don't like nobody. <laughs> when you get your antisocial ass, <laughs> you go home, sir. Lisa, you go home, sir. He got a picture out. 
He got like 19 cars parked behind him, all of them different makes and models. They all got the same paint scheme. They all red on black. And the caption said, I got all else on my report card. <laughs> Is that it? You said that shit like that was something to be proud of. Uh, <laughs> <no. laughs> For real? All else on your report card, like, yeah, they said I wasn't going to be nothing, but now look. You know who got all A's on their report card? Everybody who see they, your check before you get it. All right. Or it's like your agent, director, <laughs> your manager, no. radio people. Them all, the nigga who painted the trucks red and black for your stupid ass. <laughs> Don't you know he got an A in truck pain? You know, no. Oh, A in truck pain. I blame you, new parents, for that shit. <laughs> Y'all done talk to these kids that you ain't got to win in life to be a winner. Right. Hello. I'm an 80s baby. The only way your ass got a pizza party was if you sold the most candy bars, read the most books, <laughs> or your team won a championship. Yeah. God damn it. Personal pain for your defeat, stupid ass boy. <laughs> No personal Losers pain. Losers get tuna fish sandwiches. Winners get pizza. Not what tuna you fish about? sandwiches. We used to have to shake, team, and shake hands with the niggas who had just kicked our ass. Yep. They call that shit good sportsmanship. We yes. all had to line up telling yes. them good game. Good game. You kicked my ass. Good game. Good game. You dunked on me. Good game. Way to go. You don't do that shit now. Everybody just take our run and go back to their damn locker rooms and shit. <laughs> like when I was coming up, the word no didn't inflict nobody to harm. So like when we were hollering at women, she said, no, nah, cool. Hey, how you doing? Hey, man, God bless you. You uh, said, no, nah, all right, well, fuck you too. Hey, man, uh, how you doing? God bless you, all right? Because I know before I get through asking, somebody, somebody go, go yeah, hello. Rejection don't hurt. It don't. These niggas these days ain't never been rejected. They have not. Hmm, he preaching now. Don't tell them, no, nah, he'll just block her ass on Instagram. Create a new profile, shadow follow her ass. Yep. Start talking about somebody. These same niggas that be shooting up public places and shit, they ain't never heard no. Nah. Like, <laughs> I get the phone number. Hell no, nah, to ugly ass. I'll be right back. <laughs> you finna come wet this hoe up? Now I'll come back in. Yeah. Oh, say no to me. <laughs> Dog. That's so. Man, hey. Homie was preaching, bro. Homie, homie was preaching, bro. That's that is true. Nowadays, men don't they don't know rejection. They can't don't. Can't tell a nigga no at all, bro. They get they mad, just, frustrated. Like, like, they don't know what what to do. Man. Like, he's like, bro, it's a it's millions Million of people females and world. males in this world. You ain't gotta be, you know, succumb to just one person, yeah, exactly. bro. You can. Hey, he was preaching, bro. Hey, that's why I like black woman. It's bro. plenty like, of fish in this sea. Yeah, nah, he, he did his thing, man. Nah, for real. But nah, if y'all enjoyed that video, man, you already know what to do. Right uh, we up. Can check out some more of his stuff again. Seen him live, and he was funny as hell when we saw him. So yeah, he was funny. Make sure y'all keep on supporting the channel, you know what I'm saying? Your boy, your girl, trying to run it up. I'm trying to be trying consistent to to for y'all. You know, get us to 100K. We doing our thing. But nah, we love y'all. Keep on supporting. It's more dub. It's Nisha. Catch y'all in the next video. Peace. Okay, now do you see me now? Success is in the making. You've been holding me down for a while. Our conversations, they've been getting to me. You know they getting to me. The expression on your face when you look up to me. It's like when I look